Hey guys, CZ here again, and now we're playing Majora's Mask again, so let's start this bitch. So, last part, we got the, the Deku scrub mask, so let's equip that. And we got back to Ogreen in time. So, now we're back to normal. We played the Song of Healing, so now we're going to go do stuff, actual stuff that we can do. So, first of all, let's activate this bitch. You know, something really confusing about the owl statues is that they told me that you had to hit him with some sacred sword or something. And I always got so mad because I thought that you were going to get the master sword or something. Uh, uh, oh, excuse me. In this game. But it turned out that, no, that's not exi that's not at all what you were going to do. But anyway. Uh, I think I still have to be a Deku Scrub to destroy the balloon so now we're gonna go get the bomber's notebook because that is a big part about getting all the masks i think so just blow that up and now we take this off what's up yes Let's play hide and seek again And I'm pretty sure it's going to give me the same exact code this time. Uh, now that I've learned freaking... <laughs> the order you grab them in has nothing to do with the code, apparently. So... Ah, crap. Come here. Come here, you bitch. Pretty sure it's a lot easier to catch them that this way. There we go. Uh, I hope that didn't just affect my game. Uh, we'll find out in a second though. I think you mentioned something about uh, were we playing alone or something. But, hey, the postman! Yeah. Love that guy. Ah, crap. I used to get him right. Ah, oh, God. Alright. The trick is to corner them. Alright, okay, now we gotta get the other guy over here. I think the last mask in this game you can really get is the couple's mask. Because uh, the Ajun Cafe quest is kind of a big one. There's uh, multiple parts to it. But right now we're more concerned about getting the bombers up. So. Ugh, god damn it. No, come here. Damn it. Ah, oh, you bitch. Come on. God damn it. This is this, why is this so much harder this time? There we go. Okay. So now we got wait two more guys left really where's the other one I already got two of them no I got four of them already oh I think it says I caught their leader while I was wearing the Deku scrub mask so he got confused Alright, so I'm gonna go deal with that. I am getting the biggest craving for pizza right now. Alright. Yep, I got all those got, got all those assholes, so now I gotta get, get their leader. Shit. Fucking headbutted right into the goddamn wall. Hey, hey, you asshole, you want to move out of my way? Yeah, fuck you. 
God damn it. Can I, like, shoot him? Oh, yeah, I don't have an arrow. Or bow. I don't have, I don't have the hero's bow. Or fairy bow, I think it's called in this game. No, I think it was hero's bow in this game. Thanks. Alright, sweet. Now we got the Bomber's Notebook. This is a pretty important item to have in this game if you want to get the masks, so... There you go. Three, four, one, five, two. Yep. So I think I had to re-help the fairy for some reason. Because I think she makes you stronger somehow. Or just says she, she makes you stronger. I don't really know. I don't remember this game much. Like I said in the first part, I have not played this game in good five or six years. Alright. And... Straight fairy. There we go. Fortunately, we cannot skip by water like normal. Or not... No, this is normal. We cannot skip by water like in the... Using fucking... Deku scrub. There we go. That's the right way to say it. I'm pretty sure for some reason when you go into the clock tower, time stops. So there's that. Stop. Alright, let's go help the gate fairy with her problem. Hello. Again. Okay, so you literally gain nothing from helping her out. Nice. Oh, yeah, yeah, you get the fairy mask. There we go. Yay, we got our first mask. Kind of the creepiest one, but hey, whatever. Definitely ugh, looking. I think I can go up the slide somehow. I don't remember how. There's a heart piece up there, and I want to get it. I don't think I've ever gotten that before. Something I'm probably not going to be doing for this Let's Play, by the way, is getting all the heart pieces, because I've uh, never really done that before in any Zelda game. Uh, not worth my time. Not that I have time to be worth of, anyway. But god damn it. No, get back up there. Oh yeah, I did get this one. I remember. Because uh, it's super easy. So now we got two pieces of heart. And we need two more to make another uh, heart container. And we'll have four hearts. I thought it was really interesting that Skyward Sword starts you out with six, I think, or seven, which is uh, pretty cool. So we've been recording for a good nine minutes, I think. Nine or ten. No, damn it.
crap. Damn it. Oh, it's just so bad for Anju. She's all timid and scared of everything. Well, not really scared, but so just unsure and... I just feel bad for her. Sad. There you go. That was where I was going. Alright, I have nothing to do there. Um, I... Oh, yeah, I can get the Keton mask. Oh, and I can get the cafe mask, too. I should probably go do that. Before it becomes nighttime. I don't think you really go any faster when you roll, but... It, I think it makes you feel better. It makes you feel better. Sup? You are a little flirty. So, Thank you. Now we have two masks. Well, technically three, but whatever. And there's Toto. <laughs> Toto. Some people down in our notebook. There's only about 20 people that you have to help, but there's like 54 masks or something. Or I think my county was way off. Alright, so you've got two, three, four, by six. So there's like 30 masks or something. Six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-four. There's like twenty-four masks. Never mind. Yeah, there's a uh, twenty-four masks. I was way off. I don't know where I got fifty-two from. I think I just pulled that number out of my ass. But whatever. So one thing that we'll have to learn is the song of double time. Yeah, <laughs> double time. And then the one that slows down time. Uh, four, one, five, two, I think. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Can you walk any slower? I'm sorry, you're walking too fast. You're scaring the pedestrians. You were walking so fast. Okay. I highly recommend it to always be wearing this when you pass by through here, because you'll just go by a lot quicker. So, do Deku Scrubs just like rain, or do they like all forms of water? Because, uh, from what it looks like, uh, they don't like water, because they just skip right by it. Because I'm pretty sure when you fall in the water as a scrub, you die, or something. Hey, what's up? Teach me a thing. Yes. Mm-hmm. 
Okay. Yeah, I'm not playing a song for you. Fuck off. There we go. Inverted song of time. There we go. Yes. See? It makes the game go a lot slower. Well, not the game, but the time in the game go a lot slower. And it's very highly recommended that you do that when you go into t uh, t uh, dungeons. Oh, uh, crap. Uh, sorry, I hit the mic. Uh... It's very highly recommended that you do that when you go into dungeons and such, because that way the time will not pass by, like, quick as fuck. And you can actually do stuff, and not have to save and restart the entire dungeon. Oh yeah, so, I, I love this game, but one thing that always kind of was annoying was that you had to finish a dungeon in one go, or else you'll have to restart it. So... If you're like a busy person, Majora's Mask probably not the greatest game for you, but but that is why the game would be so great to have on the 3DS, uh, and I'm pretty sure that the creators said that them said that himself um, that it would be good because a lot of people got kind of bothered by the how you're so gripped by time in the game, and that it'd be good to just be able to close your DS and put it to the side that way you can come back to it later instead of just having to restart the entire dungeon or from wherever you were and whatever you're doing all over again so i'm just gonna let the time go by again just to show you that uh you can do that and how much faster time is going to be looking like it's going again See, it goes a lot faster, and then you got this. Then you got the song of double time. Just skips you straight to the next night or day. So if it's night, it skips you the next day, and if it's if it's day, then it skips you to the night of that day. So I think we got all the masks that we can get at this moment. That I can think of. Oh yeah, we can get the Keton mask. But I think you have to get those at night. So. It always interests me that during different days, the music in the town will have different sounds to it. So I'm going to make it nighttime. I'm gonna make it night time to so I can get the Keton mask. And then I will end this part by restarting and saving. Damn it. Damn it. Alright, let's try again. Oh yeah, you can. Sweet. Sorry, I was just uh think making sure that I could st that it still had the sword spin from the Okay, it doesn't. Apparently. So it only has the smaller one. I thought it would go to the orange one and, you know, take everything out, but I guess not. One thing I'm also going to be doing is getting the gold dust sword, because that's kind of like the best sword ever. Ah, crap. How do you do this? God. Pretty sure you don't use the Great Fairy's Mask. Pretty sure I could just look it up, but... You know, where's the fun in that? Except I'm totally gonna do that right now. 
Okay, so as I just found out, um, I completely forgot, but getting the Keton mask is actually part of the Anju and Cafe wedding quest thing. So, we can't get that yet. And the only real use it has is getting you a piece of heart once and like 20 rupees whenever you want. So, we have really no use for it right now. But something we do have to check real quick is... Uh, oh yeah, those Rosa sisters practicing. Uh, let's see if I can learn the... Oh yeah! Oh yeah, now I remember. So you don't have to completely restart every time. <sighs> I completely forgot you can actually save at these owl statues. So, no. So you can't just save and keep going. You have to save and quit. So, I completely forgot. So, uh, disregard my comment earlier that you have to restart a dungeon every time. But, uh, oh yeah, the Rosa sisters are over here practicing, and you have to go talk to Garo, and I forgot how you summon them. But if you help out the Rosa sisters, then they have this, this whole new dance routine that Gorman needed. But, uh, anyway, I think I'm gonna end this part right here, because, uh, we don't really have anything to do, but, um, when we come back and continue, we will go to the swamp and start our first temple and junk. So there's that. There we go. Okay. So while that does that, I will do my outro. <laughs> Wait, did I have any money on me? Hold on. Yeah, we had 11 rupees. All right, so I guess we're not saving just yet. It's silly me. Yes, I remember how to use my notebook. Pretty sure it's right here. Yeah, right there. Okay. So, now we're gonna speak to this person. That's not a lot. Okay. There we go. So now we're going to save and return to the first day. And this is where this part will end. So, I would like to thank you all for watching. Uh, if you like my videos, then subscribe. If you don't, then that's okay too. Uh, hope you have or had a nice day. My name's Cece, and goodbye.